BMW iX, the BMW iX3, the BMW i4, and all of the many BMW electric models to come are making a strong statement in electric energy efficiency and driving range. The BMW iX, for example, brings unprecedented constructional advantages in efficiency to the table. It has the lowest air drag coefficient in its class, supported by aerodynamic wheels and an active air flap system, it has an efficient new heat pump technology and a whole lot more. At the same time, BMW continues to support customers in making best use of the e-drive technologies. BMW electric vehicles come with features and services that make their specified electric driving range more than just lofty theoretical figures. All right then, let's take a closer look at the intelligent BMW e-drive regulation systems, connectivity services for XEVs, and the high voltage battery and charging technology. And let's find out how customers can have all of that work together best in order to enjoy a maximum of sheer electric driving bliss. Everything you need at first to literally keep an eye on your e-drive is in the instrument cluster right here. In the BMW iX3, the digital instrument cluster shows at one glance, besides your speedometer and the power meter, whether the drivetrain is using or recuperating electric energy. The state of charge of the high voltage battery, the e-drive mode to which the vehicle is currently set, and the current range are shown as well. In EcoPro driving mode, the instrument cluster also shows feedback from the route ahead assistant, and we're going to get a bit deeper into that in just a minute. The upcoming BMW iX will go even a step further with the new Efficiency Coach, and it will be able to display the range prediction showing calculated range tendencies for the current energy consumption for a lower or a higher one to help you optimize your range while driving. Using the My BMW app, when your car is parked and you're somewhere else, you can also read your current state of charge and your current driving range off the vehicle status. When currently plugged in, the vehicle status also shows the estimated remaining charging time. And the latter, by the way, is also shown once more in the vehicle instrument cluster. So what can we do to always keep driving range as high as possible? Some significant and very easy to control factors might just as easily be overlooked. Yet those are physical influences on the energy consumption of driving. So how can you extend your range? Well, for example, by always removing luggage accessories, like bike carriers, when they're not needed. They counteract the aerodynamic performance and decrease range substantially. Even keeping the windows and the glass roof closed can have the same positive effect. Also, avoiding unnecessary additional load in the vehicle in general reduces the amount of energy needed to drive. Another circumstance of driving range is tire pressure. Customers should check their tire pressure at least twice a month and before any long journey to keep energy consumption from the rolling resistance most efficient. In the iX3, the digital tire pressure monitor and the tire pressure label even show a specific eco-inflation value. One by now hopefully well-known precaution for efficient range before the journey is preconditioning. Whenever possible, climatize the interior of your EV automatically or remotely using the My BMW app while it's still plugged in. Because while driving, air conditioning is one of the biggest range-reducing auxiliary consumers in the car. On the other hand, we have BMW Maps to help you prepare your e-drive journey and reach where you want to go. The navigation system can display the most efficient route to your selected destination, taking into consideration things like topography and speed limits. It also visualizes the possible reach of your current driving range with a circle on the navigation map. And if your selected destination lies beyond that circle, BMW Maps can add charge points to your route. Then, once you've hit the road, there are two main factors for range efficiency. First of all, your actual driving style, and second of all, certain vehicle settings while driving. Now let's take a close look at how much energy heating and cooling really consume while driving. 
If we take, for example, the 9 kilowatt heating unit in the BMW iX, its power already represents almost a tenth of the energy the 100 kilowatt hour high voltage battery can provide per hour. So, after driving for one hour with the climate control on, consuming theoretically a full power of 9 kilowatt, the energy content of the high voltage battery would already be reduced by 9%. And of course, the energy used for powering heating, or cooling for that matter, is lost for driving. As already indicated, the driving mode Eco Pro, when used correctly, is the most range efficient one. Selecting Eco Pro individual, you can decide whether the system supports you with a more efficient use of vehicle functions. It regulates air conditioning, seat heating, and also exterior lights, rear window, and mirror heating in ways that go easier on the high voltage battery charge. Eco Pro mode helps with efficient driving because it is optimized for moderate acceleration and deceleration. Generally, moderate acceleration means keeping the e-power indicator in the instrument cluster always as near to the zero position as possible. Naturally, efficient driving also means using recuperation to your full advantage. To do that, make sure to set the recuperation level to adaptive in the menu. This way, the system can regulate the e-drive system for the best balance between coasting, acceleration and deceleration once you take your foot off the pedal. And that is where the Route Ahead Assistant in Eco Pro mode comes in, which reacts to events coming up on your route. When the established foot off the pedal symbol is displayed, that is exactly all you need to do to allow the vehicle to decelerate with the best benefit from recuperation. To make Eco Pro mode, adaptive recuperation, and the Route Ahead Assistant work best, active route guidance from the navigation system is required. So, do advise your customers that BMW Maps is not only there for them when they don't know their way around. There is obviously a whole lot more to it. Finishing touches to your own driving efficiency can be set with the help of the familiar driving style analysis. <laughs> Efficient driving and trip planning are the one thing, but they mean absolutely nothing without charging correctly. Apart from the ever-improving charging times for BMW i models, do also keep in mind that the charging process itself is always considerably faster from 0 to 80% state of charge than the last remaining 20%. And that becomes especially significant when it comes to longer trips. Let's say, for example, you travel the more or less 800 kilometers from Munich all the way to Hamburg in a BMW iX3 with a maximum range of 458 kilometers according to WLTP. Now, if you would try to charge up completely about halfway through the trip to go the rest of it on one charge, you would lose a lot of time charging. Charging more often along the way, but only up to a lower state of charge would take you to Hamburg a lot quicker at the end of the day. Just take these figures. Charging the iX3 with its maximum charging performance up to 80% only takes about half an hour, but to charge it up to 100% takes over one full hour. On the other hand, you can extend the range of the iX3 by 100 kilometers with only 10 minutes of high power charging. Make sure to look at other specific product trainings, such as the BMW Customer Charging Experience, and also learn all about the newest fully electric BMWs. That way, you can obtain all information about different charging solutions and charging times. Another important factor to make charging more range efficient is charging up to a program departure time. When you use the charge and climate menu feature right, the high voltage battery is already at its ideal temperature when you drive off and can develop its maximum performance, meaning it can store and provide its maximum of electric energy for maximum range.